Right, golf mates, you have clicked on this video out of pure interest. What have I got in my hand? Obviously, it's the two worst rated putters ever to be made. Are you ready? What I've got here is a ping dock. This thing is massive. Play the music, Joel. Now this thing is 17 centimetres wide. Now the reviews, not by me, by these people, are here. They didn't take kind to it. Branding iron, been round Mr Barlow. Yeah, <laughs> but I've been getting hold of it and I've had a couple of little putts. I'm going to disagree. This putter might be going in my bag and I'm not joking. But we're going to have a head to head against a putter we got sent to review. I'll be honest, we don't do reviews, but if it's something funky, I said, we'll do. Now, he's asked us for do a review, it's not gonna be a kind review, because Mr. Barlow started this review, he's done it twice, and I don't think I could put it on her. Mr. Barlow, yeah. you have got the straight shot. Yes. Pictures up there, we're making our own reviews up about this. And Mr. Barlow, yeah. first impressions before we go into about it, what is it? Uh, I think the best part of it is the handle. The grip. What about the rest? Well, it's, it's plastic. <laughs> it's plastic and it comes apart. <laughs> I've never known a putter in my life to come apart. So you're saying it's not well made? No. Would you buy that before you even test it? No. Why? Uh, because I don't like the head of it. Is that it? It's plastic. Well, plastic the place here for get us for rest us for yeah. doing a, a review. Right, plastic. so this is the worst rated, rated putter ever to be made. And we're putting up against this straight shot because we think it's the worst putter ever to be made or ever to be seen by me and you. Yeah. No, Mr. Barlow, you don't use it. <laughs> you don't use <laughs> That's what happens, it's the biggest load of rubbish. $249. You're joking. Is it's it not more than that? More. But anyway, it's $249. You, you don't put with it. Like it's that, traditional. you've got to do it. Show us, Mr. Barlow. It's pushing, it's like it's, hoovering. So it could be, I hoovering. want to break free. It'd be better for curling. <laughs> and you're not allowed to stand directly behind the ball. And a push action. Would it not suit someone with yips? It could do. I mean, out of 10, what would you give it? And I want you to be honest without swearing. I'll give you one for the grip. <laughs> That's it. Right, so we're going to get on a nice green, we're going to get some balls out and we're going to do a scientific test. You ready? With loads of numbers, data. All them numbers and data are getting you. I know there's golf geeks watching this, want to know the data. Well, you've got it all now, so digest them numbers. So, Mr Barlow, should we get on a green and have a little... Uh, yeah, giggle. Some Yeah, but I think this could be staying in my bag. Honestly, this could be a video of what we've done because this got rated the worst putter ever made. It might not be by me. I might use this today, and I'm not joking. I might use this today. Right, golf mate, so we're on the green. We've got four Pro VXs, brand new from Dan Gavins' bag. We're both going to have a go at this ping. We're all right sharing clubs, we're in our own bubble. No, Mr. Barlow, let's be honest, I've been playing with this today. Yeah, so you're used to it. And I've not done all right. I've not done rubbish with it. I've not done no, bad. It, no, it's been all right. Okay. So how we're going to do this test is this. We're just going to have a couple of putts and we'll see if we can get a bit of a feel. And we're going to keep talking while we're doing it because we want to try and make it interesting. And we do know it's not really an interesting video. That's against the grain, look at that. Look at that. no one here. Yep, against the grain. So that can get hit then, because we know it's slow, don't we? Yeah. Longer. I mean, it's really slow, that. Oh, that's gone well. Let me move them. Yeah. But I'm still saying I really like this putter, but, and I mean but, the grain's pointing that way with the C. I like it, I've got some clips of me using it there. But right, Mr Barlow, it's slow, mate, even though it's downhill, the nap's that way. This is the biggest putter I've had in my hands. It's the biggest thing you've ever had in your hand. Yeah, massive. 17 centimetres. I can see it, I can see it breaking. What a great port, well you've just showed me up where. We're gonna let Mr. Barlow do this one because I've been playing with it and he was laughing at me. Oh, you give that a whack. That stayed out. Go on, finish him off. 
Tommy, Tommy, what are you thinking behind the ball? I was just thinking I can't miss the ball for starters. Yeah, but you can't miss the ball with a putter. So that's a useless comment. So what else? Uh, it's how to control the swing, isn't it? And the, the Do you bit, like it? Bit, bit of the it's all right, yeah. It's not for me personally. It's too big. <laughs> Never had that problem, though, have you? That's one. Do the line, do the line. Because I can't wait to get hold of this other putter because, well, I've got a feeling it's not going to be great. No. Come on, Mr Barlow. <sighs> Little bit out the side. Right, Mr Barlow, let me just ask you straight. Is it the worst rated putter in the world? Uh, it's OK, but it's not for me. OK. It's too big. So, golf mate, so Mr Barlow, I think he's a politician. I asked him a very simple question. Mr Barlow, is this the worst rated putter in the world? And the answer was, it's OK, it's not for me. So he's given me two answers to a question I've not asked. Mr Barlow, yeah. is that the worst rated putter in the world? Apparently so. Oh, for God's sake. But what's your opinion? Yeah, it's too big. So that's the worst putter in the world? It's called the big dog. Big dog. Right, let's get this other one out. Right, golf mates, the one you've been waiting for. The straight shot. We've already worked out the build quality is horrendous. It's just a piece of plastic. And the uh, only thing I can see here, my point on this, this one, is the grip is beautiful. But it just looks like it's just some stripes you get, like, you know, your old cars and you put some go faster stripes. Uh, so, right, you cannot do that. That is highly illegal. But you can go that way or this way. And I'm going to be straight, just practicing then, because we know this green's nap, it's fast that way. Yeah. So the grain is this way, so we're going against the grain. You, you know, I'm, I'm really trying hard there to push is it that. Sticky? Yeah. So let's have a go. I mean, straight away, this is just a disgrace, this. No, it's not. <laughs> Nearly. <laughs> Bill's over there. I'm lining it up great. And I'm good to the side, so it's not illegal. No chance. Punch it. It's gripping. It's not even sliding. It's, it's not the physics of putting, is it? No. Pushing. I mean, I'm going to be straight with me. That, that is the worst putter I've ever seen in my life. And I hate it. I don't want to call it because someone's put time and effort into it. And I don't want to be disrespectful, but it's, it's got what you're doing there, one-handed. Yeah, it's just, I'm just going to push it. But it, you can feel it gripping the nap. Is that the worst putter in the world? It's terrible. Is it better than that one? No. This is the worst putter I've ever had in my hand. But you said that's the worst rated putter in the world. Well, apparently so, but I've, not, I've only just got this in my hand. <laughs> so this is the worst one. Right, go on. Just I don't like, uh, I don't like the head of it. Plastic. And it falls <laughs> off. <laughs> Might be best you fuse it this way. <laughs> huh? What do you think? I think it's this way. That's a better effort. There's more power sideways. <laughs> With the go faster strikes going the opposite. Hey. That's, two, that's $249. And? Well, I think it's $239 too much. So $10 for the grip? Yeah, that's it. I mean, someone's made this. I don't want to be too rude to him. <laughs> well, he's not going to make a fortune out of this, is he? <laughs> I mean, look at that. When do you have a putter that falls to pieces? A shaft that goes into a plastic head. And it's smooth, so it should, if anything, shine on the turf. Is this, the worst, is this the worst video we've ever made? This is, yeah. It's garbage. <laughs> well, I don't think we should do reviews. We're too honest, aren't we? Too honest, yeah. He's yeah. never going to make his fortune selling these, I'll tell you that now. Would you buy one? No. <laughs> do you know anybody who would? <laughs> yeah, maybe Ray Charles might use this. For any shirts. Look. It's better for curling. Curling or on a pool table. Right, Isn't so it? on that note, golf mates, uh, go on, get it in, I love it. Go on. There's nothing wrong with it. Go on, go on, go on. You're on a roll now, maybe you just needed it. <laughs> I've told you I'm the swing doctor, I can adapt. I mean, this, this is shocking, this. The swing doctor, he adapts. I'm not be, but you've just two potted. It's great, isn't it? <laughs> So is, it, is the putter better now? No. That's the worst putter I've ever used. So what should we do with it? I think we should have been closer to seeing slung in there. 
<laughs> on Martin Orton Golf, mates, we're going, we're, we're not great at reviews. We're either too honest or we don't know what we're doing. But I think, I think too honest is fair because that ping, you, you might not like it. I don't, I don't mind it. But this thing's horrendous, isn't horrendous. it? There's, there's no ifs or buts. You cannot say that's good for anything. Terrible. On that note, if you're still watching, thanks. <laughs> Don't forget to press the like. Oh, yeah, give us a like. We'll see you tomorrow with a better video.